Rocket Men, The Daring Odyssey of Apollo 8 and the Astronauts Who Made Man's First Journey to the Moon is a 2018 non-fiction book by Robert Curson recounting NASA's 1968 Apollo 8 mission, which was the first manned spacecraft to reach the Moon and return safely to Earth. The book is Curson's fourth, and it debuted on the New York Times bestseller list. Topic. Background Kerson drew on hundreds of hours of one-on-one -on -one interviews with NASA staff, industry experts, astronauts including all three Apollo 8 astronauts and their families as source material for the book. In November 2017 the Martian author Andy Weir reported that he read an advanced copy of Rocket Men. Topic. Synopsis Rocketmen is an account of the Apollo 8 mission with focus on Frank Borman, Jim Lovell and William Anders, the three astronauts aboard during the mission. The book also places an emphasis on the astronauts' families during the mission, from the Washington Post. Rocket Men opens in summer 1968, with the space race in high gear. The Soviet Union had already put the world's first satellite, Sputnik, as well as the first human, Yuri Gagarin, into Earth's orbit. The Soviets were projected to reach the Moon by the end of the year, months ahead of the United States. The book includes chapters dedicated to each astronaut, the space race itself, and background and chronological progress of the mission including critical maneuvers and mission setbacks. It is set against the backdrop of 1968, considered by many to be among the most divisive and violent years in American history. Reception The book reached number 7 on the New York Times bestseller list and has received positive reviews from critics. The USA Today called Rocket Men a first-rate account of this remarkable spaceflight, and added, There are many pieces to the Apollo 8 story, but Curson brings them together effortlessly. The New York Times called the book, gripping, and a riveting introduction to the Apollo 8 flight, in which, Curson details the mission in crisp, suspenseful scenes. Writing for The Washington Post, Mary Roach compared the book to Alfred Lansing's Endurance and John Krakauer's Into Thin Air and called Curson's writing style as close to a movie as writing gets. The film rights to Rocket Men were secured by Macaredi prior to the book's publication.